think you can hear me. Um, yeah, this is end of game 12. And today we're doing first let's play of Broken Sword, a game you've probably not heard of because it's pretty old. But it, I, I don't know, I like the game. It's take, yeah, you can see all my files then. It's taken a while to um, start it all up because I, uh, I kept messing it all up, but uh, I finally done it now. So I uh, hope you enjoy. This is just the opening. This might be very Half into the game than we lost one, but they must have changed it quite a lot. Okay. So yeah, the clown blew um blew up. It's a bit of a shame. Okay. Yeah. This is kind of like a strategy game. You gotta do puzzles and stuff like that. It's uh. It's As I picked myself up, all I could hear was the ceaseless drone of traffic. Life went on around me. But the explosion was to change my life forever. Alright, um, I'm gonna go in there. Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy this, I know. This is my Yeah. I tried not to meet his stare as I searched the dead man's pockets. No wallet, no papers, no credit cards. The guy's past was a blank page. Oh, I feel sorry for you. I think she's still alive. Right. I don't know. Well, actually, what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna do a stopwatch because because of the software I'm using. It doesn't. Tell me how long I've been recording for so much news. Oh on. my head. Never again. How much I vodka did I drink? Oh, how long don't tell done. me. What is your name, Shelly? George Stobart, ma'am. Oh, yeah, George Stobart. American. She asked the question quite innocently, but I could uh, sense her reserve. Yes, it was something which yeah. seemed to afflict all Europeans. You look like you could use a little help. I could use a little drink. I feel sick, dizzy, and bruised. I don't even remember the party. Just relax and take it easy. You've been knocked out. You don't say. What happened? There's been an explosion. You should try not to move. Are you a doctor? You don't say, uh, yeah, well. Yes, I am. I studied under Dr. Benton. Who is he? Only one of the most brilliant medical minds on this planet. He taught me everything I know about medicine. I think I'll do it after Can you remember anything at all? Know. No. I need a drink. Pour me a brandy. Like parts you save. Well, uh, Is that straight or with ice? Just give me the bottle with a cheat on it. I guess a little drop won't hurt. Oh. Yeah. <sighs> That's better. She knocked back the brandy as if it was water. I was glad I wasn't picking up the check. What about the old man? Is he dead? Yes, he is. Oh, mon dieu. I've never seen a real life corpse before. Except for Grandmaman. That was different. She was family. As he... 
Gun stiff? I shouldn't think so. He's only been dead a few minutes. Remember what the clown... Do you remember what happened when the clown entered? I remember that horrible tune he played all right. It was like a funeral dirge. I'd never liked accordion music either. Mm, clown again. Did the clown speak to the old man? No. He just laughed at him. Then he, he grabbed the old man's briefcase and ran out of the door. Did you see what the old man had in his briefcase? No, he didn't open it. Did you know the old man? No, monsieur. I never saw him before. How did the old man behave? Well, agitated. He kept looking about him at the door, at his watch. As if he was waiting for someone? Yes, I suppose so. He was worried about something, that's for sure. If you ask me, he was having an affair. He had that look about him, like a guilty husband. Yeah, so I got the grey bars and the screams. That's, that's in this game. Did the old man try to stop the clown? Like oh, he didn't have a oh, chance. The clown dropped his accordion and ran out of the door. That's it. That's all I can remember. Okay, uh... What did the old man do when the clown snatched his briefcase? Nothing. He just sat there like he was frozen. Okay, yeah. Stay here, mademoiselle. I'm going to look around for evidence. Hold it, or right there. Oh, don't shoot. I'm innocent. I'm an American. Can't make up your mind, huh? I demand to see the American I consul. Drop your weapons and get down on the ground. Put that thing oh, away, sorry. Sergeant. Yeah. I apologize, monsieur, but I cannot permit you to leave. Am I under arrest? Ah, uh, no. I would simply like to ask you some questions. En avant, yeah. to so the cafe. Peace. Marsh. I'm getting all the notifications. What a mess. This bombing is an outrage, is it not? Stop that, monsieur. Yes. Stop holding your breath at once. Has it occurred to you that he may be dead? Move. Oui, monsieur. But I prefer to look on the bright side. Besides, I recall a case where the killer escaped by feigning death. However, in this case, the man is quite dead. Clearly, the killer knew of his presence and... How many times have I warned you about premature extrapolation? All we know is that he is dead. It seemed reasonable to assume... A great detective assumes nothing. Take Maigre, for instance. But, but he was a fictitious character, monsieur. Why, he was no more real than Poirot or Tatin. That's a different move. They were comedy Belgians. Anyway, it is unlikely well, that just, even um, you will oh, learn yeah, much from talking know. to it's the dead. It's going to take a while to complete this. It takes about Examine the girl five hours to complete this statement. game. And that was when I watched a playthrough of something completing it without failing anything. I didn't watch the whole thing, but I saw the time. I doubt but, uh, if she is I did uh, get this for questioning If you want to get this game for PC, if you have a PC, it smells to me it as if she has been Windows. drinking. As I feel, uh, Windows 10, so we have stumbled upon a den of but, um, iniquity. Leave her to me, sir. For the I am used to handling drunken women. And it was brand new, I do not uh, doubt that for one, one moment. So hey, Matt, now, if you would like to do business, yourself, then I don't know. You can do that if you want. Oh, sorry. I was just. Your name, please? George Stobart. I'm from California. 
And what brings you to Paris, Monsieur Stobart? Travel. I'm touring Europe. You chose well. The city is most beautiful at this time yeah, of year. Yeah, in Paris at the moment. No? And, well, I guess uh, exactly, yeah. but yeah, George is, so. um, he is American. Lasts. Were you in the vicinity of the cafe at the time of the yeah, explosion? Yeah, I don't know why I'm telling you all the yeah, obvious stuff. Yeah, I was sitting out on the sidewalk. I was lucky um, I wasn't killed. The inspector passed over my remark with no reaction. Did you see the deceased enter the cafe? Um, yeah, I did, I think, didn't I? Yes, I did. Was he alone? I mean, I don't know uh, why to do yeah. don't do that. And did he say Not anything to you? To no, he was more interested in the waitress. Did you see anyone else in the cafe? Uh, yeah, the clown. Yeah, there was a guy dressed as a clown. He was carrying an accordion. An accordion? Bon, the picture is forming in my mind, and it is not a pretty one. Is the girl all right, Moo? She'll live if she survives the hangover. She says the American claimed to, to be a doctor. He forced her to drink the brandy. I can explain everything. Can you, monsieur? Almost everything. Eh bien, I have heard enough. What do you mean? I am satisfied that you know nothing. You may leave. I hope this little incident does not spoil the rest of your vacation. What about my personal safety? Can't you at least give me some advice? What can I say? Stay alert and look out for suspicious character. And don't cross the road until the little man shows green. <laughs> Great advice. I honestly believe you are in no danger, monsieur. Should you remember anything of importance, please contact me. My card. Thanks. That is all. You may go. There's not much to go on, monsieur. On the surface, no. no if the door can only be opened. Are you academic? You are about to witness a scientific breakthrough. Yeah, there's five games, but uh, yeah, the only the first three came in the pack. Oh yeah, this is as a final is. Excuse me, Mademoiselle. Hi, my name's George Stobart. Oh, an American by the sound of it. Yeah, that's right, on holiday in Paris. Some holiday, huh? You were here when the bomb went off? Sure was. Yeah, Sat right out Nicole front of the cafe. She Did you notice the a middle-aged man, maybe 60, with an ad and a I couldn't believe it. She hadn't even asked how I was feeling. Was yeah, he went inside just before the bomb exploded. You weren't related to him, were you? Oh no, nothing like that. I am Nicole Collard from La Lipite. What's that, some kind of nightclub? No, it is a newspaper. You're a reporter? I'm a freelance photojournalist. Say, you can interview me about the bombing. You know, an eyewitness account. Minutes after the outrage that shook the whole of Paris. You know, real life drama, human interest, that kind of stuff. I'll just stick to the facts, thank you. Did you see who planted the bomb? I know it sounds crazy, but he was dressed like a clown. Oh God, it's him again. Right, okay. Uh, I guess I'll talk about the clown. Have you met the clown before? It's a long story. I have plenty of time. I don't. Uh, Who's the guy you were supposed to meet? His name was Planter. I didn't know him, but he called me last night. He said he had a story which would interest me. Yeah, he asked me to meet him at the cafe. Him. I yeah, guess I'll never, never know what he wanted to tell me. Uh, not unless you have Rosso's gift for psychic interrogation. I can't say this much better, I feel. I don't know. They're both pretty much. Why won't you tell me about this clown? Why do you want to get involved? Because he almost killed me. Isn't that reason enough? I guess so. Listen, I'll give you yeah. my phone number. A clown looks nothing like a clown cane, but I mean, what do you expect? You help me with my story, and I'll let you in on what I know. And let's get one thing straight right now. 
This is strictly business. Okay, it's a deal. I have to go develop these pictures. A bientôt, monsieur. Fine, I'll uh, see you soon. Keyboard only games and they're rubbish to be honest. No offense to any keyboard games. But um yeah, this is online. Right. You, know, you just use the mouse, so I don't think I'd like to use the uh keyboard work support and I think it's gonna pause the game. Yeah. Oh no, no, no. Okay. Okay. Yeah, let's escape. Okay. I think I I can't do anything. I took a deep breath and prepared to climb the drain pipe. I guess the clown had an escape over the rooftops. No. Um, yeah, I need um, tools to do this, but I don't know. I don't know if I do this. Some of the dialogue. I tried to lift the cover with my fingers, but couldn't gain any leverage. Oh, okay. I'll go on here. Nothing else. We can just kill, I think. Okay, we'll go. Oh, sorry, you should probably have my mouth close to the mic. Um, okay. Um, I've got now. And, uh, see this guy? I was making questions. Yeah, he didn't care. <laughs> he just stood in my way. Minecraft one, yes. Hi, can you spare a few minutes? I thought you'd been arrested. No, it was a misunderstanding. When he pulled that gun, gah, I thought <laughs> that was it. Those automatics by quite a bunch, you know? He made a mistake. He thought I was a terrorist. You? A terrorist? Ha! He was only doing his duty, I guess. Got a quite a loud voice. Did you see a clown come by this way? A clown? Like, in a circus? Yeah, with makeup and a big red nose. Ho! Oh, those guys are funny, aren't they? Not in my experience. I love the circus, especially the horses. You haven't answered my question. Have you seen a clown? You think I've got time to watch everyone who passes by? Some of us have to work for a living. Look, I told you already, I didn't oh. see a thing. He was wearing multicolored baggy trousers and makeup. He'd be a poor sort of clown if he didn't. Let me know that, okay. Did you see an old guy with a briefcase? Wait, silly old coot. Do you know what he said to me? Work fascinates me, he says. I could watch it all day. Care did. I could have knocked this block off. I think that's all we do Did you recognize the old man? No. Should I have done? Was he a celebrity? No, but I guess he is now. His name was Plantar. Was? He's dead then? Yeah. That's too bad. Now I wish I hadn't called him what I did. If only I could turn back the clock. If only I'd been more tolerant. Regret and remorse are strange emotions. They really bring out the hammiest actors in people. Oh. <laughs> right, um... Listen, I have to find that clown. He's a killer. Say, who are you anyhow? A cop? No, of course not. I mean, do I look like a cop? I guess not. How do you know this guy's a killer? Did you see him in action? Didn't you hear the explosion? The cafe was blown up. The clown killed the old man? That's right. Blew him up with a bomb concealed in his squeeze box. Merde. But why did he go to the bother of dressing up like a clown? Who can unravel the tangled logic of a killer's mind? I guess it's some deep-seated psychological need. Or just plain showmanship. Okay, um... I gotta go. Don't let me keep you! No, hey, you! Even... What do you want now? I gotta go. Don't let me keep you! Can we get anything from there? 
Don't touch that phone! Sorry. Hey, stop that! Get away from there! What do you think you're doing? I was admiring your toolbox. Are we? Had a good look, have you? I'm warning you, if you touch it, I'll crack your nut! Oh, okay. Okay, I get your point. I don't go that way. Okay. Mm, what is that way? Oh, yeah, we can choose where we're gonna go then. Um, so, I'm going to the police station. Yeah, that's where we just were. Even though he had grey hair then. Okay, yeah. Oh, this is a different part I know. Maybe I can use those phones. Excuse me. Not so fast. I'd like your personal details, please. Huh? What for? In the event of an accident. It would help us to know where to send the body. Look, is this really necessary? I came in here to talk to Rosso. Ah, oh, why did you not say? Okay. May I see Inspector Rosso? He's not here. But do you wish to leave a message for him? I have a choice of blue or black pen. I'd recommend the blue for a less formal communication. I'd prefer to talk to him in person. As you wish, monsieur. Okay. Is Sergeant Moo available? What? You want to speak to him? Yes, please. I cannot recall the last time someone asked to speak to Moo. No one ever speaks to him. Not even his kids. Ah, bien. <laughs> He's not here, monsieur. He is with Inspector Rosso. Like Laurel and Kitten. No, monsieur? Hardy. Oliver uh. Norville Hardy. Okay. Have you had any reports concerning a suspicious clown? Why, yes. There was a fracas only this morning. Three arrests for public disorder. And you say there was a clown involved? A clown and a particularly offensive piece of sculpture with balloons. Are you in any way involved with the reprobate, monsieur? No, not me. I think he is, but I don't know, maybe he's talking about someone else. Okay. Do you know anything about Rosso's psychic techniques? I cannot comment on my superior's methods. All I will say is that Inspector Rosso has an impressive record. He's a good detective? One of the best. He's a man of honor, with a fine sense of beauty. You wouldn't huh. say he was... Yeah. Uh, a screwball? Not to his face, monsieur. All right. Uh, yeah, we'll Thanks for your help, officer. Call, um, you know, the one we got me from, the, the uh, phone number four, Nico. Yeah, I'll just quickly see. Oh, yeah. Bonjour, couleur. Oh, hi. It's George Stobart, the American at the cafe. Ah, oh, oui. Uh, you said to call if I could help. Have you any news for me? Well, I haven't had a lot of luck. You found nothing? Uh, no. Look, I'm very busy right now. Call me if you have any news, okay? Oh, yeah, I guess. Adieu, monsieur. Yeah, see ya. What else can I do then? Is it <laughs> pointless? I need to get into the sewer in um uh, in the cafe by the cafe, but I forgot where the uh, the tool is. Can I talk to him? I, I don't think I can go in here. Can I? The door was securely locked. Hey, you! What do you want now? Take a look at this. You told me you weren't a cop! Don't shout about it. I'm working undercover. 
Who are you looking for? That's confidential. Uh, hey, you! What do you want now? I gotta go. Don't let me keep you! There was nothing inside the tent except a large toolbox. Hey! What did I tell you? Don't touch! Okay, I'm... Hey, you! What do you want? What's in the toolbox? What's in the toolbox? As if you didn't know! What's the big deal about tools, anyhow? They're cool. Tools are civilization. <laughs> you don't say! That's right. Tools are what distinguish us you from other say. animals. Who are you calling an animal? I've met your sword before, <laughs> looking down your nose at me because I'm working class, huh? I've a good mind to knock your block off. <laughs> what kind of tools do you keep in your box? Huh? You really are interested in tools? Sure, like I said, tools are... Yeah, civilization. So you keep saying. So are you gonna show them to me? Am I? Why you? Oh come on, just a little peek. I've got work to do. Find someone else to bother. What? Come on. Do you have a tool for lifting manhole covers? As it happens, I do. Cool. Lend it to me, uh, just for a few minutes. No. Oh come on. No. Get your own. Let me explain what I'm going to do with your manhole lifting tool. Let me explain what I'm going to do with my peak. <laughs> oh, hey, forget it. I'll come back when you're in a better mood. It doesn't get any better than this. Uh, can you talk about this anymore? Check out my card. I've seen it already. Uh. Check out my... I've seen it already. Yeah, I gotta go. Don't let me keep you. I considered straightening the table, but I figured it best not to disturb the evidence. Oh, there's still there. Oh, what can I pick up? I think it's the newspaper. The leading article referred to the visit of a Nobel Prize winner from some unpronounceable Eastern European state. That was the only news story. The rest was rumor, gossip, and sensationalism. Then I noticed the oh, yeah, writing this at the foot of the page. Days. It read Salah ed Din, 1345. I forgot to tell you that. Well, you probably, if you saw my last video. Uh, also... Is there a way you like fire? Oh, yeah. Maybe I can do in the newspaper. Uh, that is not a good idea. Oh. It was a par oh. It was a Paris daily tabloid newspaper, full of sex, scandal, and sports results. Oh, nice. Uh, okay, I guess, um, maybe he'll want the newspaper. Maybe he'll let me get that manhole lifter. Hey, you! What do you want now? <laughs> Would you like to read my newspaper? Hmm, please. I haven't got time to read that. Can't you see I'm busy? You could read it on your lunch break. Ten minutes is all I get. And if my boss had his way, I wouldn't get that. He'd have me on a drink, so I didn't have to stop to eat. Oh, take the newspaper and quit complaining. Look at this! Damn bleeding out liberals! Cha! Save the dolphins! Catch them and eat them, I say! All that fuss over a bunch of fish! Nah, that's more like it! Look at the size of those! 
Like champagne bottle corks, no? Ah, what's this? Saleh Din running in the Prix de l'Arc de Triomphe. It's a racehorse? A horse? A legend. Bucephalus reborn, mon ami. Like a streak of lightning, she is. Alright. So. I'll talk to you anyway. Do me a favor, won't you? Yeah. Keep an eye on my hull. I'm off to put some money on that knight. What about your toolbox? Stuff it. Help yourself. Oh, yeah. Okay, he actually lets us. I found just what I wanted. A tool for lifting manhole covers. So, now we've got that. That's kinda cool. Um. Anymore, but I probably didn't need it, it was nothing that important. Oh, wrong way. Okay. I felt like a little transition thing when you, um, when you go into the inventory and just like makes a little pan. Why am I, why do I care about this? It's easier to interact with stuff on PC because it was like so hard. You just have to like get it in a certain position of the screen. You have to, like drag your fingers like. Was, like, was, like I lifted the cover to reveal what smelt like the entrance to a sewer. Oh, okay. Can I just do that? No. Yeah, the keyboard's only used to hold apart from the um, menu. So what the uh, type is so much fun. Mm. Oh my gosh, can I even hit this? Well, I've made it to the sewer. I think that's one of them, is it? Oh, this, uh, you time was past, past fast when you play this game, honestly. Okay, I guess, um, well, we've made it to the sewer. We'll do stuff. Oh, there's a nose over there, yeah. We'll actually do stuff in the sewer in the next video. Well, uh, I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next video. Let me just save this. Do a save slot, yeah. Uh, save one. Yeah, okay. Right there. Um, okay, everybody. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.